Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Zach. You guys can call me Hazardous. Thank you guys so much for tuning back into my channel and welcome back to another Fortnite video here on the channel today. And in today's video, guys, we have a lot of stuff to talk about on this Tuesday, March 27th in Fortnite Battle Royale. So before we get into this video, I do want to let you guys know about a thousand V-Buck giveaway that I am giving away to you guys in the comments and in the description down below, guys. All you guys need to do in order to enter this thousand V-Buck giveaway is to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to turn on post notifications, drop a like on this video and drop a comment down below letting me know which skin you want to win in Fortnite Battle Royale because I do give away a thousand V-Bucks every single day in my item update videos. If you guys do want to check those out, feel free to go down into my Fortnite playlist that's linked down in the description as well and you can check out all the item shop updates because I do give away a thousand V-Buck code down in the description and in the comments. But the Rogue Starter Pack was released today in Fortnite Battle Royale which basically for the price of $4.99 you receive 600 V-Bucks, the Rogue Agent outfit or skin and you also receive the rogue agent back bling so you technically do get a lot of stuff in this you get the free skin the free back bling and you also get an extra 200 v bucks on top of your purchase or 100 v bucks on top of your purchase it's totally worth it but that's not the focus of this video guys the focus of this video is the new guided missile coming soon into fortnite battle royale and the description says remote control destruction from above so that can mean one of a few things Obviously, it's a guided missile, so basically what's going to happen is you're going to shoot it and it's not going to be like an RPG. It's not just, you know, a straight line rocket into your target. You're going to be able to probably choose the target like a javelin, like aim it, say, at the top of a mountain. And then once the target is locked on in the guided missile, you could shoot it and then the, t um, the missile will fly all the way over and blow up that specific point you had targeted and marked on your weapon. That's one way it could work, or it could be... This is something I can picture Fortnite doing and Epic Games implementing into the game because that type of guided missile will be too overpowered, especially if it just takes typical rocket ammo. Because the fact that if you get a guided missile, all you need to do is just aim that at a fort all the time and you will 100% get a hit on the fort. Like You can aim it at the base of a fort and you'll be able to knock it down right away. What I think what they're going to do is they're going to make it harder to use by the fact that you're going to need to aim in with the guided missile. And as the rocket is flying towards the target, you're going to need to aim your guided missile weapon at that specific target as the missile is in flight so until it hits the target and blows up you would need to continuously be aiming at the target for the missile to track otherwise it'll just go straight on whatever trajectory or path it's heading on and then when it blows up you know you won't have any control over the rocket that's kind of how I think they're gonna implement it um, I can't really see this weapon being too overpowered if it's implemented that way if it, if it's implemented like a typical RPG where you know all you need to do is aim at the target, wait for it to lock, and then shoot. That'll get really annoying, especially if they're um, adding in those jetpacks, which I haven't seen any more updated info on those jetpacks. If they're even going to add those in, if that was just like a canceled DLC coming into the game. One thing I love about this guided missile DLC, though, is the fact that they're adding all these things. I mean, it's a weekly update now of new awesome skins, and they're adding a weapon every single week. And something I can see them doing in the future is them doing kind of like the, the path that Rockstar takes with Grand Theft Auto 5 online is the fact that they drip feed weapons and content and cars and DLC to people every single week. So every single Monday or Tuesday, Rockstar updates the GTA Online servers with a new car and some new weapons and, and clothes and things like that in the main DLC. DLC that comes out a, a couple months, you know, after each other. So within, you know, call it if it takes three months to release a DLC for Rockstar, they release 11 weeks of like new DLC cars, which is pretty cool in my opinion. Let me know if you guys want to see more videos like this on the channel. Let me know what you guys think about the guided missile DLC coming into Fortnite Battle Royale. I have to wonder if it's going to release this Thursday, if it's going to release ne next week. I think it's going to release this week on Thursday in the new like 1.52 update, I think it is. So stay tuned on my channel for more videos. Thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel. Like I said, if you want to enter that 1,000 V-Buck giveaway, I am going to be uploading the Fortnite item shop video tonight in which I will be giving away the 1,000 V-Bucks in that video. And to enter that giveaway, all you guys need to do is subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications by hitting that bell icon next to the subscribe button, drop a like on this video, and comment down below which skins and which content you would like to buy with the 1,000 V-Bucks. Thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel. I hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I will see you guys in the next Fortnite video. Adios, amigos.